What's up guys, Jarv here, back today jumping into Destiny. My mic is switched on this week, and Zer is on Nessus, over by the Proving Ground Strike, which is actually the first nightfall of Season 17, uh, and he's over in the Witch's Grave, which you can find over in the top side of the map. So there we go. That's where Zer is located. As for the loot this week, let's have a look, see what goodies he's got for the last week of Season of the Risen. Uh, we've got the Telesto. Oh no. He's going to break the new season before it even starts. <laughs> the legendary weapon is back for 29 legendary shards. Um, so yeah, just pick it up if you haven't got it, I guess. Uh, for you hunters, we've got Gemini Jesters. 60 stat with a high intellect of 24. Misdirection, so dodging disorientates and removes enemy radars. Really good for Crucible. Catches me out a lot. Well worth 23 shards. Not the greatest roll though, but that's a good intellect roll. We've got Actium War Rig. 61, so not the highest again, but decent recovery at 20. Auto-loading links is steadily reloads your equipped auto rifle or machine gun mags, which is pretty neat. Uh, machine guns get a nice buff next season too, so it might be worth picking up if you're considering using those, and that's well worth 23 shards as well. And then for your warlocks, we've got Verity's Brow. 60 stat again, so not the highest. Also, we've got the fourth magic, so energy weapons kill boost grenade damage. So yeah, Verity's Brow is very much a slept-on exotic for warlocks and could be quite good next season, actually. So again... Not the greatest rolls, but not bad with next season just around the corner. Uh, as for legendary weapons, we've got the Serenity Seren Sidearm back with Hit Fire Grip Elemental Capacitor, Whispering Slab with Quick Draw Demolitionist, Eternal Blaze and Returns with Killing Wind Unrelenting. We've got another Long Shadow with Snapshot Sight's Explosive Payload. Widow's Bite again, he can't get rid of this. Firmly Planted Disruption Break, the Serenity Seren Saw with Autoloading Holster Vorpal Weapon. Hey yo! Is he dishing out the God Roll machine guns before they're even godly? You might want to pick that bad boy up ahead of Season 17. Practically a good roll there. And we've got Royal Entry with Phil Prep and Thresh. So there we go. Definitely the machine gun being the standout weapon of this week. We've got the armor set from Season Rivals here. The old Holdfast set. We've got 66 on, 66 on the gauntlets, 57 on the chest, 65 on the helmet, and a 65 again on the boots. So pretty high stat rolls. And then for the rest of the exotics, we've got Eye of the Storm on the Hawkmoon. It's been a while for this. We've got Textured Grip, Alloy Mag, and Small Bore. Interesting. Nice stability stat of 68 as well. So it might be worth a look for you Crucible gamers. And then we've got Outlaw on the Dead Man's Tail uh, with Composite Stock, High Cow, and Corkscrew. There we go. Quick look at Zer, the final Zer of Season 16. We'll be back on Tuesday for the launch of Season 17. So enjoy Trials until then, and good luck on your cards. If you've enjoyed this video, be sure to check out the other videos here on the channel, as that super helps me out. I want you back into the game as always, and I will catch you all again very soon.